your girl Crystal. Hey guys, it's your girl Crystal. Hey guys, it's your girl Crystal. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I know you guys are probably like, what's happening? There's two people. When I'm here with one of my good friends, Destiny. She's amazing and she has her own channel. And her channel, you guys go ahead and follow her. Her channel is All Things Des. So all things and then underscore D E S S. We'll put everything down below. So she has amazing videos on how to install lace front wigs. Her wigs are amazing. They're bomb. You know what I'm saying? And um, for today's video, I just basically was kind of bored, and I told her like, I'm tired of my curly hair. What can we do about it? And I know she does like great installs on lace fronts. So. And I ended up buying a wig, and she's gonna teach me how to install this glueless Bobby Boss lace wig. I actually got this one off of HairSoFly.com. Mm -hmm. And it is the London wig. It is actually in the color MDLF004. I think that's what it is. Yeah, so the color is a T4-3327, and the style is London, so. See you guys we'll let y'all get all the details. In. Now we're gonna get started, and now we're gonna show you guys how to install a lace front. Let's see what we got planned for today, guys. Okay, so we're gonna get started with how you prep your wig before you put it on your head. So I'm gonna be teaching her how to do this process. So we're gonna take the wig out the box and So this is the color pretty much next to her. I think it's gonna be pretty cute. Yeah? Yeah. At least it's not that dark. <laughs> okay, so it does come with the um, adjustable band. It does have the inside. You can see here. Get close to the camera. See there? So we're just gonna put the wig on the canvas head. And since it already has baby hairs, we're gonna just, I like to comb them back. So I'm just get back a little bit so they can see. And pretty much, I'm gonna teach you how to do this process. So you wanna take your comb. Okay, so first you wanna put your wig and just get it adjusted on the wig stand. And then you wanna just start combing back your baby hairs. Um, I'm gonna part it a little bit. You want a middle part or you want? Yeah, a middle part or You can part it any way you want. So pretty much you wanna get a wax stick. This is the one that I use, uh, my hair care. And you wanna just put the wax stick and then I'll do this for you here. Like that? Mm -hmm. Oh fuck. Oh, you guys know me? You guys know I'm not coordinated. No. <laughs> Suck. Okay, so you wanna put it back. So you wanna put enough so like here? Mm-hmm. Okay. So you wanna put enough so you can get the in here to go back. You can see right there. You just want it to go back, but you don't want to keep it on the hair too long because you don't want it to burn. Okay. So wow. only do the top portion. Only do the top portion. So put more of the wax in there. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna put, so you're gonna so I need to put some here? So I put some over here? No, you don't have to. This is part right here. You just want to get it back in that. Oh, okay. Because it's gonna have gel on it. I mean, you know, not gel, but the. Okay, so you want to just get it on here good enough. So, okay, see how that looks way better. It does. Wow. And then you just take the um, the pressing comb and you press it, and that's that's the one you plug into the wall. So. And then what's going on? Just press it back so you press <laughs> press it back. So keep try to keep the shape of in here, but just okay. press it back a little bit. Oh shh. Okay, 
And you don't want to leave it on the hair too um, long because you don't want to burn it because it is synthetic hair. So you want to make sure that you're pressing this back with the pressing comb and not um, making it melt, but you just want to melt down just the front part. And this is just enough. Um, we can always go back and fix it if we need to. But that's pretty much it. It's on like one of the highest settings on here. Um, now that we prepped the wig, we did the pressing of the frontal, we're gonna get started with applying the wig. But first I'm gonna braid her hair down and then um, we're gonna move on after that to the application. So. braiding my hair back. Des did all the comb rolls. She only did one, two, three, four. She did four of them. So now we're gonna go ahead and apply the wig. Yep. I'm excited. actually went ahead and just did the bald cap method just because we thought it would be a little easier for me just because I have a lot of hair. Why did you put alcohol? Just to help the skin um, get all the germs off, of, not germs, <laughs> all the dirt off so it could be clean and ready for it to apply because it'll help it stick better too so you don't have oils on your skin. It kind of dry your skin out like that maybe. Now we're just putting all of the baby hairs back using got to be glue. Now we were just using a hair dryer just so we could have the baby hairs back and for them to just stick into one place. Now we're just going to go ahead and cut the wig cap along my natural hairline just so it could kind of stick. Now we're going to go ahead and use the Bedhead Extreme Hold Hairspray. And of course you want to go ahead with a hair dryer and dry it just so it could get tacky and ready for it to stick on the wig. And now to some more cutting along the wig cap just so it could really look perfect on me and make sure that it blends well and protects my hair. Stop. 
go ahead and wrap around the lace front just so it could kind of stay in place yeah, baby. now we're gonna go ahead and cut out the lace and make sure that it fits naturally fine on my natural hairline and just make sure that it blends along the hairline just so it could create a more natural look to it and for it not to look very wiggy. Now we're gonna go ahead and wrap the baby hairs just so it could stay into place and for it to look bomb. just going to go ahead and brush out the curls just so I could give it a more natural look to the curl itself and this is the final look I look bomb Thank you guys for watching and make sure to go ahead and subscribe to to like this video and make sure to follow my friend here and her channel all things underscore how do you say? It? I suck at it. All things best. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> we'll link you down below. Yeah, she did an amazing job installing this wig. It was amazing. I mean, we were gonna go a little more of a having me trying to do it, but we. I we actually got these kids that would let us be great, so we had to get it done. How we had to get it. Yeah, so we just had her transform me. And that's little Arya. She's cute. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching and make sure you stay tuned for the next video.